We are now joined in the studio by director Ace Cruz and Hollywood actor Michael Madsen. It's great to be here. Welcome to the Philippines. I feel so welcome here. It's like a second home to me now. Can I just say, dun 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 He's only the second Filipino director that I ever heard of, mm -hmm. and ironically, I got to come back visit because of the film I made with him. Mm -hmm. I just think he has an interesting vision of things, and and I'd like to form some kind of alliance or some sort of new company with us together. I came here um, as an actor. Mm -hmm. Alfie Lorenzo brought me from the U.S. Mm -hmm. after I graduated from USC. I went to the theater school and the film school. Great. That's why I have both aspects in, in understanding actors and also understanding the technical side of directing a mm -hmm. film. Acting, producing, directing, all at the same time. Mm -hmm. that's, a big, that's a big deal, you know. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's not easy to pull that off. And he did that, you know. And I, I mean, I, my hat's off to him for that. Those are three different uh, hats, very different hats that you have to. It's a lot take. of things to think about. Yeah, yeah day, exactly. You know. How do you tend to balance that out and, and juggle those things? Well, I, I do a lot of meditation. I have to be very patient with a lot of people. I, I'm actually a, like a psychologist on the set, understanding what's going on. I mean, I have like the grips fighting with the makeup people or the sound guy fighting with the first AC. Mm -hmm. And so I have to sort of, as a producer, I have to help those remedy that situation and take that up and go back into concentrating on the direction of it. And if I have to take that up, now I'm focused on every moment that whatever job I'm doing, I'm focused on mm -hmm. it. I have to forget about producing, I forget about acting if I'm directing. If I'm acting, then I have to just turn on and just be the actor. You know, as a producer, you can create your own stuff, right? I mean, if I was just as an actor or as a director trying to get work, mm -hmm. then it'd be a different story. But, so I never felt it because I was always the one making things happen. I do believe in destiny, and I do believe that certain people are meant to do certain things and certain others aren't. And, but I think perseverance is the main thing. Mm -hmm. And if you just don't give up on something, I mean, you know, sooner or later it's got to happen. If you believe, if you honestly believe it yourself and you can convince yourself of it, I think sooner or later it'll start manifesting itself in your life. Or well, as a filmmaker, you know, I really totally understand that aspect on how to make a movie in Hollywood. Mm -hmm. From a script, from concept, all the way to distribution and marketing. I mean, I go from all the way from the editing process, and that's why a movie takes three years for me, because I'm not just the, the director, I also have to produce it, and then after it's done and finished, I got to make sure that my investors make money. That's why I would go to work for someone like him, because, mm -hmm. you know, I like kind of the underdog mm -hmm. aspect of things. I'm a big Brett Favre fan, mm -hmm. for the same reason, you know, somebody who keeps trying. I think that's what ACE is all about and you know you talk about racial prejudice or just crossing the barriers of different cultures and it is pretty tough to get into the Hollywood uh, system be a Filipino or anything else other than what people are used to thinking is the way that it's supposed to be or the normal director type that everybody thinks is the stereotype of what makes something great and you know it's really uh, it has to be changed sooner or later. 